Hi there, welcome to another week of Connected Conversations. It's Lorena Seidel here and my special guest, Juliet. We are going to teach you today how to meditate. And this is something for you to do as a family or for you to do with your students. And uh, here is what um, meditation is all about. So meditation is about quieting our bodies, um, centering ourselves. And some people think it's about quieting their minds. Stop thinking. But that is quite impossible. Our minds are always going. We may quiet our bodies, quiet our voices, but it's really hard to quiet our minds. And what we're going to do is not to try to quiet our minds. We're going to look at what's coming up in our mind. There are always things popping into our minds. And these things are, can you give me the first one? What is that one? Sensations. Sensations. So maybe when you're, when you're uh, closing your eyes to meditate, you might be feeling like the wind blowing in your face or listening to cars pass by or your own breath or you can hear noises or voices, right? Those are sensations. What else pops into our minds? Judgments. Judgments. Maybe you are, judgments are thoughts that are either positive or negative about things or people. So maybe you are judging um, someone or something, like I'm excited I'm gonna go out today, or oh, I don't like when my sister does this to me. And so you're just judging. What else happens in our mind? Memories. Memories. You might be trying to meditate, you might be meditating and memories are popping up. Things you did yesterday or a long time ago may come up while you're meditating. What else? Thoughts. Thoughts. So thoughts will come up too while you're meditating. Things like, oh, I should be doing laundry or I forgot to reply that email or I want to play forgot to do my homework, things like that, right? And then something else comes up into our minds. Emotions. Emotions come up to into our minds when we're meditating. So maybe you have your feelings of being angry or sad or happy or lonely or tired, and you are thinking about that um, while you're meditating. So now that you know all the things that pop into our mind, right? When you meditate, we're going to do this together. You are not going to try to stop your mind. You're not going to start uh, try to quiet your mind. You are just going to notice these things popping into your mind and you're going to let them go. You're just not going to hold on to the emotion. You're going to acknowledge, hmm, I feel sad. And then you let go. And then when a thought comes up, oh, I forgot to do my homework, you're just going to let it go. You're not going to invite the things that are popping into your mind to sit with you and have tea with you. You're just going to let them go. You're not going to entertain that thought. You're not going to keep going. And when you have that memory, you don't need to relieve the entire memory. You can just notice, oh, I'm having a memory. And then you let it go. So shall we try? You want to ring the bell? You can do one dinging and we're going to do it for 30 seconds. So sit comfortably. You may close your eyes or just lower your gaze. And then for a few seconds, you are going to say what is popping into your mind. You can actually literally just say what's coming up for you. We'll do it together. I hear the girls come in the the cages downstairs. I hear cars. I'm thinking of everybody who's going to be watching this. I'm wondering if they're gonna like it. I feel a little tired. My bag's been bothering me a long time.
and reach for it. Something coming up for you. So how did that go? So what I would like for you to do next is do another two rounds of this. So you do it for 30 seconds or a minute and you just tell out loud what's coming into your mind. Then the next round, instead of saying what is coming into your mind, you actually say one of these things. Just say a memory, a judgment, a sensation, an emotion or thought and then so you just label it and then you do another round with your students or your family and the third round you don't say anything you all stay quiet and you just categorize in your mind almost as if there's a little drawer for thoughts a drawer for emotions a drawer for sensations and on and on and you're just putting things in the right spot in your mind. You're just organizing. <laughs> so then you spend 30 seconds to a minute just organizing these things in your mind. And this would be how to start to meditate. This is our the way I usually teach um, students and parents and teachers on how to start a meditation practice. And Obviously, there are so many amazing things about meditation. It's so good for us, and there's so much research behind it now. We know it's, it lowers our stress. It can help us regulate, and it changes our mood. It helps us focus, and there are so many great benefits to meditation. So go ahead, give it a try. And um, if you have any questions or comments, just let me know. Have a wonderful week. Thank you. Bye. Bye.